Ladies and gentlemen, Mrs. John Hay Whitney and Postmaster General Tisch. Reagan. The President of the United States and Mrs. Reagan. Well, please be seated. We're here today to honor one of the great figures in American medicine and a pioneer in the field of surgery. Harvey Cushing is rightly known as the father of American neurosurgery. He was an extraordinary doctor who served on the faculties of several medical schools such as Yale and Harvard and was responsible for many breakthroughs in neurological surgery. Today, his work is continued by the association that bore his name when it was founded, the American Association of Neurological Surgeons, a gathering of North American neurosurgeons who carry on the high professional and scientific standards that characterized his life and work. Besides his professional and scientific accomplishments, this noted doctor had other signs to, sides to him. His former assistant, my father-in-law, Loyal Davis, noted once that he had learned not only clinical neurological diagnosis and surgical techniques from this man, but many other things like professional discipline and dedication, not to mention, as Dr. Davis put it, how to write a medical article with style. Like the others who've been honored by the issuance of a stamp in this series, Harvey Cushing is an American who made a difference in his chosen field, a man whose professional dedication and personal genius advanced the cause of science and medicine and made a difference in the lives of countless people. And now, with the help of Postmaster General Tisch, we will unveil the stamp, and after that, Nancy and I look forward to meeting each of you shortly on the state floor in the White House. Thank you. 